Hello, welcome. Thank you for stopping by today. If you are a return subscriber, I thank you for giving me some of your time. It means so much to me. And if you found me on your suggested side, a video you might like, uh, please consider becoming a subscriber. And up here on this channel, I try and, and upload every Sunday, Wednesday, and Friday. And um, I review wigs that I buy on my own money, um, whether they are, usually they are on sale, or they might be clearance wigs. And in today's case, it's an open boxed wig that I purchased from the wig company. I bought several. And um, I'm excited to see what this is about. Um, a few of my subscribers had, they commented and told me that they have done this and that they didn't see any problem with the wigs that they did purchase. Uh, before I forget, today's wig is the new Vibrant by the Wig Company. Um, this is in Strawberry Blonde, which I believe is the number 502. Um, the colors I got today are on the same order. They are in the red zone. And I will be reviewing whatever one comes out first. That's the one I'm going to review. And the other one I'm going to save for another video. So without any further ado, let me open up this nice sealed box. I ordered this, uh, I'm going to say like Friday. And today is uh, Wednesday that I'm uploading it. Um, so I, I received it actually this I'm doing it Tuesday for Wednesday's review so um, that's pretty fast I mean I think it was Friday late afternoon I ordered it too okay so let's see what this is, means all right so inside let me stand up for this I have my my uh, paperwork here's my paperwork telling me what I got Oh, they are in the box. There they are. They're in the boxes. I was wondering how that was going to come. I thought maybe they meant open box means they weren't going to get an open box. The new Wig Company catalog. Well, there's there's hours of fun. Okay. <laughs> and okay, I'm going to take one out. I don't know which, which is which. I'm going to take one out. And this one is, okay, this one is Frolic, number 27 in average. Final sale. Frolic, okay, Frolic is a $79 wig, and um, let's see, it is a basic fashion club house brand. She normally goes for $79, and I got her for $16.88, plus tax. The shipping was free on these two wigs. Um, I was also at the place to order. And I waited the next day for whatever reason. I waited till the next day I got up. And they had, it was on their uh, statewide or, you know, whatever, free shipping today. So I got this for free shipping. So I really lucked out on that. Okay, so again, this is Frolic, average size, number 27, final sale. Okay, so let's see. Now, that's it. <laughs> that's all there is. Okay, let's see what Frolic is going to be. Now, Frolic is 2.1 ounces. She is a three and a quarter inch front, two and a half. Can't even get the thing off of it. Okay. Now, somebody, one of my subscribers had said that hers came with uh, tags. Um, this one does not have any tags. The tags have been clearly cut off of this wig. Okay. So here she is. Okay, Fro Frolic is 2.1 ounces, three and one quarter inch front, short, right? Uh, two and a half inch top, two and a half inch sides, two and a quarter inch back and nape and a half inch extended nape. Okay, so there she is. She's stretching, uh, basic cap, felt ear, adjustable straps, no felt ear, I'm sorry, just plain, plain ear tabs there. No felt on there. And no felt on the extended nape. And she is a very short wig. Now, um, let me let me get my let me get my wig grip. Because I like I said, this is open boxed. Although I think that this is perfectly safe, I am going to put on a wig cap for you. Okay. Bye, new vibrant. Okay, fix this. I'm sorry for that. Um, well, I guess I don't need that. It's great to be putting on this. Now, excuse me, because I really don't wear these too much, so I may not get this all in there first. Oh, that was pretty easy. Okay. <laughs> okay, here she is. Frolic. It, 
there is nothing to this wig i'm telling you but i bought this for the summer for mowing this is going to be i figure for 16 dollars i can do this outside wow this is really let me take off my glasses this is really short guys there is metal stays oh god my let me get my glasses up oh, she's cute oh i now let me know what do you think uh some people said the shorter hairstyles make me look younger i thank you for that some of you say uh that i need longer lengths i thank you for that too um six and one and half a dozen and the other i get i'm getting all kinds of mixed reviews um i did show my mother the one that i had just opened the other day i can put that video here from the wig company and she I, she didn't see me in person i showed her the picture of it from the video and she absolutely loved it uh that was a sitting pretty she loved that one so okay let me give you the full 360 here left side right side And the back. Let's see. She is short. Short and choppy. Now, let's see if I can pull an old thorn trick here. And there's not much, there's not much fibers to wake up, guys. I mean, there really isn't. It's uh really short. So there's not much other than spiking it up. I don't think there's much more I could do with this. And I think in the picture of her, this is what they did. They, they spiked it up. Okay. Let me get up close and personal so you can see. And I, the bangs are cute. I like that. There's the front. That's cute. I mean, this is exactly what I need um, to stay in the red theme. The red zones, I call it. And to put on my, I didn't bring my cap out, but I have a three quarter inch, um, visor, you know, the kind that, that adjusts snaps in the back. That's what I wear. So here I, I could even wear this to the beach, put on my glasses. Let me know what you think. I can already see the comments are going to be coming in. I hope the comments are coming in. <laughs> okay. There's that. And it is cute enough to wear a little headband if you want to add some color. I have yet to buy, I have one, I, and I should have grabbed it, but it's in the other room. Um, I really wanted to get some, um, you know, spring headbands and see what they look like. Okay, so there she is, frolic. I'm all set to go frolicking. Uh, no, really, I think she's a cute wig. Um, I, I, I love the fit. I love the fit. It's not tight. It's not loose. It's just perfect, and I didn't even touch this, the, the stays. I kept them on exactly where they came. Um, so, yeah, for $16.88, I'm happy. I'm, uh, this, is, this is perfect. This is what I need to go outside. It's cheaper than what I had purchased last year on Amazon. Um, it's better quality than Amazon. I mean, this is an $80, $79 wig. So, like I said, I'm very happy with this. Um, now I know what open box means. Like I said, I wasn't quite sure if it meant it came without a box in a bag or if it came unmarked box, but they did give you that little bit of information. So that, that's good. I mean, you know, I'm happy about that. So thank you, wig company for doing that. I love the color. It is, it is redder than say the new vibrant. Um, but it does have, it, this is called light gold red so you can see that there is a gold red in here um you know it is it is still in the red zone it's just there's there's a, a little bit of a a highlight to it i want to say you know you do definitely see some gold and there's no sun out right now this is like uh four o'clock five o'clock in the afternoon so um i think when the sun hits it and this is only from my my uh soft box light that i made here so i think it looks pretty cool um i love the colors and, um, you know, yeah, I'm excited about this. So please let me know. Give me your comments. Um, uh, is this a hit? Is this a miss? Is it, is it something? I mean, I think for the money, like I said, I'm very happy for it. And for what I've gotten. The next one I'm going to do, 
was even less than this. Okay, so that one I'll have to wait for another day. Um, that one, I'm, I'm anxious to see that one too. And now it's going to hurt me or haunt me to see it sitting in that box and not open it. And guys, I don't open it. I, I, I really wait. I mean, what you see is what you get. I open it up and there it is. Okay. So this is straight out of the box. Frolic. Give you another 360. And like I said, when I get my visor out of my storage, I think it's I think it's going to work very well. It's not a whole lot of hair for the visor to sit and the adjustable strap in the back. Um, it worked very well with my other wig that I purchased last year from Amazon. I, I tell I wore it, and that was a that was a lot of hair. That was a a light L wig, and it was blonde, and it was a lot of hair. And I had a sometimes I had a hard time strapping the strap and the strap the Velcro wouldn't stay in the back of the visor, and I know this one it will. And I'm sorry that I didn't think about grabbing that, but like I said, it, that's packed away. I didn't, I didn't break it out yet, um, but definitely, definitely I'll be able to wear it with this. Okay, well, um, I think that's all I'm going to talk about, and uh, you'll have to wait. Please, uh, pay, you know, I'll, I'll put some previews out there and let you know when I'm going to um, put up the other one. And uh, I have been going on Instagram a lot lately. Uh, uh, advertising or just letting you know that I'm here and I'm doing reviews and thank you for all the subscribers that have jumped from Instagram to YouTube to follow me I appreciate that it means a lot to me and um, I love all your comments um, I loved when we did the Sunday wig chat I can put that here about what's going on in the world um, I I'm lucky right now I still have a job to go to uh, so does my husband um, I don't know for how long you know, it's scary out there what's going on. And I hope everybody is staying safe. This is going to be a long, bumpy ride. Um, I, I really think it's going to be a long, bumpy ride for us. And um, I, I, you know, after a, a, a patient or customer, when a call them comes in, I work at a, at a, at a um, hearing aid supply center. Um, we have a, a protocol that we've been following since this has started. And, um, you know, paying attention and making sure I, I follow up with every person that comes in and follow where they've gone and what they've touched. And and not getting too close myself. And when they ask to borrow a pen, I have a special, you know, designated pens that I give them, don't give them mine. You know, things I should have been doing from the start, but you just don't, I oh, need a pen here. And I just give them mine. Well, now I have to be more diligent about that. Like all, like all of us, we have to just pay attention to what's going on around us if we have to go out. Um, by all means, if you can stay home, please listen to what they're telling us and stay home. If you have that luxury, I wish I had that luxury and I could stay home for, for a couple weeks. Um, and I may have that luxury if it gets worse out there. I may have to stay home. Uh, we may have to not be open for a few weeks. Like I said, I think it's going to get really bumpy and then we'll be okay. And then once it dies down and, and people are not getting as sick, or as many people as not getting as sick because now we're going to realize what we have to do and adhere to those rules, I think it's going to be fine. Um, prayer does help too. <laughs> but anyway, all right, have a great night. Thank you for stopping by. Have a blessed day. I'm going to get my clicker. I, I, I used a clicker to turn it on, and I'm going to see if it turns it back off. Um, some days it does, and some days it doesn't. All right, thank you very much, and have a good one. Bye-bye.